as the Emmy Award winning host of The Amazing Race. Is everybody ready? Yeah! The world is waiting for you. Go! Come on, Dad, let's go! Phil Kogan's name has become synonymous with living life to the extreme, but it's through his own personal experiences that he has learned how fragile and unpredictable life really is. At just 19 years old, a near-death experience while scuba diving prompted Phil to write down his life list of risk-taking goals to accomplish during his lifetime. Three, two, one. A list he not only hasn't backed away from, but keeps adding on to. I'm free! This life list grew into a book, a Discovery Channel series, and a motivating philosophy he called, No Opportunity Wasted. The time is now, and do not waste your opportunities. Grab it now, grab life by the horns, and just go ride it. The greatest risk in life is, is not to, to take a risk. Then, a little over five years ago, Kogan found new inspiration. Well, I got involved with the MS movement about five years ago when I took part in a Bike MS event because I think they're fantastic events. It's a great energy. Driven by the MS cause and to mark his upcoming 40th birthday, Kogan embarked on his own amazing race. This was going to be the biggest physical and mental challenge of my life. A 3,500-mile bike ride from L.A. across America. I wanted it to be this real pilgrimage and go out and, you know, really push myself physically and mentally. And I thought, rather than hanging out with some guys, you know, in 10 years' time, having a beer saying, oh, yeah, I rode across America, uh, I felt that there was a real need to do it for a greater cause, and I chose MS as my uh, cause that I, that I support. His 40-day odyssey of personal challenge and self-discovery was captured in the documentary The Ride. So tired. I felt this tremendous pressure not to let people down. I was so completely and utterly exhausted. And this gentleman by the name of Michael turned up and he said, I'm living with MS and I wanted to come down and see you. I heard you were coming to Omaha, and I, and I got out of bed for the first time in six months and got strength in the last three days, and I actually walked without my gate. I'm driven by these people with MS. I was watching your blog from a couple of nights ago when you were just trash and hit the wall, and I can think of, I know exactly what you're feeling. I think the people that are survivors and the people that get through this very tough world, they are the people that focus on what they do have and what they can do as opposed to what they don't have and what they can't do. Through his selfless and tireless efforts, money's received from contributions to Phil Kogan's ride. Thousand dollars? Wow, that's really generous. Along with sold out nationwide premieres of the ride film in Regal Theaters, have raised well over $500,000 for MS. And Phil has made sure that all donations help those within the local communities where the money was raised. He is crossing the finish line right here. This year, Phil has taken on two new challenges. Together with Novartis Pharmaceuticals, he's launched a first-of-its-kind cycling team, now and Novartis for MS. These women, they are some of the best riders in the world. They are world class. We want people to see what it is we're doing. We want people to be a part of what we're doing. These professional riders are also cycling in tandem with honorary teammates made up of men and women living with MS at Bike MS rides to demonstrate that people living with MS are not defined by it. Remarkably, within just 10 weeks of forming this inspirational team, one of the MS Women Cycling Team members became the winner of the 2011 Road Cycling Championship. An honor which the entire MS community can take pride in. Phil is also partnering with the MS Society to launch now an MS Revolution. This initiative hopes to raise $250 million over the next five years to fund MS research targeted at stopping the progression of MS, restoring lost function, and putting an end to MS for future generations. Every day they live with being tired. Every day they live with not being able to move. And I can move. It just forces me to get up and go. Tonight, we salute Phil Kogan, the 2011 Dorothy Corwin Spirit of Life recipient 
and our first official MS Research Champion in the amazing fight he leads against MS.